Yeah, hi Giants fans, it's uh, Kevin Sheedy, um, just bringing you a, re uh, a review of the uh, game against the Swans, uh, the Premiership side of 2012. Uh, probably the first quarter was a quarter that we let ourselves down in, uh, they got off to a four goal lead and of course uh, winning the game by five goals overall. Uh, the last three quarters or the next three quarters of the game we played particularly well, winning the last quarter. And I think in general our players felt more comfortable out there that um, they've had a lot more experience in games like obviously the pre-season, obviously the NAB Cup this year's 2013 NAB Cup season and good form probably against Brisbane and Carlton and also against St Kilda. So probably, uh, look, I think a lot of people might have been shocked by our performance but um, we were really happy with it. Uh, not happy to lose, obviously, but I think in general, you know, it's the first time in an AFL four-point match that we'd just about got the ball inside 50 more than the opposition. And um, and we didn't reward ourselves, there's no doubt about that, kicking too many uh, simple points, to be quite honest. And the, and the Swans, their goal kicking was terrific, uh, and of course they're a very, very experienced side. All in all, I think that um, our midfield uh, performed uh, admirably against uh, one of the best in the competition. And I think that um, it was great to see young John Patton really uh, play a solid game, getting us three goals and giving us a target up forward. Um, obviously, Jeremy Cameron's one of our key uh, forward line players. Uh, and I think when you get four goals out of those two boys, I think it was pretty good. I think a couple of our younger players uh, played, performed pretty well. Uh, uh, young Liam Sumner after a quiet first half. He actually came into the game and kicked a couple of goals, hit one, uh, hit the post with one, and had four shots of goal. So that's a pretty good effort by him in his first, well, probably first game this year, but technically his third game overall for his career. So we've got a lot to look forward to. I think that um, big game in uh, obviously Port Adelaide coming out. They've had a great win. I watched the game um, yesterday against Melbourne. They had a terrific win at the MCG. And of course, um, you know, uh, one of their boys had died in, in their trip to uh, America in the off-season. So that's going to be a really uh, huge game for Port over in Adelaide against the Giants next week. So a lot of it, uh, there'll be a lot of emotion in it. Uh, we've got to be very, very wary of that. And of course, um, you know, two young sides coming uh, together at each other will be fantastic for a, uh, a big crowd over in Adelaide.